consecutive matches, you've, the team has conceded big scores. What's gone wrong for the team bowling first? Uh, yeah, it's been, it has been a bit of a concern. I mean, one thing with us chasing totals, but also when we've decided to bowl first, we've actually given away big totals. So we've always been chasing high scores. You know, it was 190 on against KKR and 220 tonight. So that's not ideal. Um, but I think as this tournament goes on, we're going to have to get better at that. We're going to have to get better at bowling first, and we're going to have to get better at chasing totals. And, you know, so far that hasn't worked for us. So, you know, we have to decide as a group if batting first is going to be our best, uh, our best way forward in the tournament. If it's not, then we're going to certainly going to have to find a way to chase runs better. Last year, SRH qualified for the playoffs with 12 points. With 14 points, DC's playoff spot is still not guaranteed. How much are you guys calculating these scenarios in your head? And what's the plan for the remaining games? Oh, we're not calculating. I mean, I think we've had a rough idea from the start of the tournament, sort of how many points you might need to, to qualify. And, you know, we got to seven wins quite quite quickly and we've lost three games in a row now. So we, we have to reset right now. Um, you know, we play MI next and then RCB in the last game. So we've got two very big and tough opponents coming up. And if we keep playing the way we are, then we're going to find it hard to win those games. So we, we've got to change things and change things quickly. And you know, it's going to come down to me and the other coaches and the, and the, senior, the senior players around our team to really put our hands up and, and make sure we're getting the job done. Because the games that we've, well, performances that we've put out in the last couple of games haven't been to the standard that, ex that is expected at the Delhi Capitals.